hey and what's up guys and welcome back to NCH Software Academy today I'll be teaching you guys how to create just a basic uh, flying aeroplane so I'll just try to keep it as simple as much as you can so the moment like you open like your express animate animate this is what this is how it will appear it will show uh, this white sheet and those are uh, options then if you click option ob object those options will be available if you click draw those but I'll be showing you what I will be using and you'll just get to understand each and everything that you have to do so what I'll be doing is very basic and I just wish like to have a lot of um, uh, episodes so this gotta be the first episode of which I'll be uh, introducing to you everything that I'll be doing like um, everything so here if we click object here we load our clips of which that's what we won't be doing right now here we have a rectangle we have this ellipse we have this uh, custom shape and we have our text all those things you can see that like they are very straightforward even here we can draw using this and this and this everything here is very straightforward but we will be on the object because that's the we will be using those object mostly so the first thing you do like you, I, I zoom out I zoom in using my mouse so I believe like you also have a mouse you need a mouse so that you can be uh, try your level best to understand this then if you come from this area we have composition one from our composition one this means general means um, sequence one in our video pad for those who watch video pad for those who didn't watch video pad like no nothing about video pad composition one is just like um, the first layer that we'll be working on so this is our, the first layer that we'll be working on how do I name my layer I just come here then all the option of my layer will be available so if I come here just go straight here then you click uh, cancel then you name or just name it fly um, so here you can change it like how you want your you want your thing to be but I prefer like 16 times 9 of which is full HD I won't be moving around this area I'll just leave it on 30 seconds um, and the flame rate frame rate will be on tw on 30 frames per second but you can change it to maybe uh, 25 frames per second depending to what you want but let's just keep it on on Ted right now just the only thing like you need to focus on just name it name it fly then you click OK then your composition is automatically changed so right now the first thing we need to do is to draw the body of our airplane so we just click custom shape then we just try to create a, a body of um, an airplane so I believe this looks like a good board for my airplane then I'll start working around it changing it uh, just to see if I click there I'm just treating uh, more filler points so uh, I don't need a lot of filler points for now so I'll just click control undo control Z just to remove that point so I'll just click there then I'll just zoom 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 just click here then you see the small dot over there so from this small dot you just right click on your mouse just go straight to it when you came to it you just right click then you click on set default control points so what it will do you just open those things which those things like the flying things so the more like you you tweak it the more it will change like the shape like if I take it like this my aura plane will change the shape like that of which this is exactly what I want then uh, maybe here I can also push it that way so that my aeroplane like my aeroplane can have a, a little bit of a nose there so I'll just zoom again from here and click uh, I'll right click again so after right clicking you select the same option set uh, filler control okay let's load it click uh, remove control click here just click there and you click select control just make sure you are selecting it 
so it will it will change like um from the sharp corner to uh, a very smooth uh, kind of a curve so it's loading I don't know why every time I start to make a, a tutorial it just keep on loading so you can see like it just it just kill that um, curve but now I want like we're doing like what I did here just to create the nose I just leave it like that so even here you just try to zoom in after zooming just go straight to that point you click uh, your option just wait for it until it's finished zooming then you click option uh, it will be loading I don't know why it's taking so long that means I didn't click it just click there then you click uh, set control panel so you just do the same thing for all um, all your your points and someone if you want to know like how do I zoom in and zoom out I just I'm just using like um, a stroll button on my mouse you know that's what I'm using so just when you are zooming in just try to to the another to go to this point so just uh, try to wait for it until it's done loading I don't know it always take time so when that hand appears just click option then it just do that but you can just like uh, use this those uh, side thing just to eliminate it just to make sure like uh, the more you decrease it that means like the, there will be a big effect on like how you shape it the more you decrease it there will be no um, really like focusing on a, on a specific layer so for this one before like I do anything I would like just to take it then I push it like this way you know just so that it can be on not on, on top then after that then I zoom in uh, then I wait for the hand to appear I wait for that hand to appear um, wait for it until it's done I wait for it to appear it is taking a little bit longer then you click option then you click there then it will just kill that uh, sharp uh, corner on it so this is how it looked like so I can come here click option I go straight to rename and I can just write my fly body so that everyone can know this is an airplane body okay this is how it looks like so uh, there are a lot of things that we can do you can just drag and put it in, in between but this is still our point it has been changed um, this is our main point so how do I change the color of it before I change the color of it okay let me just click here go here click or you right click after you right click you go straight to change fill you click from change fill you come straight to this color click on that color black then you have this wheel so I want my plane to be a little bit of a white yellow uh, just come straight to yellow a little bit of uh, a yellow color I don't know how it will look like um, it doesn't look good to me let me just select click option change fill let me go for something like a gray something grayish okay I think that is much better okay so the first thing I will do right now I'll just click here again I just zoom in zoom in then I just click from that corner then I just click from here then I just click from here then that thing will appear then I can just click from here then I can just wait for that hand to appear then I just push it okay it's still loading let's wait for that hand then you just drag it and push it like there then you can come here to select um, 
just comes to there then you can just drag it like that like that like that you can see what I'm doing just trying to cover all of that then that's how I want it then um, click option here then you come straight to rename then you write it like uh, a front window then you can just click here then that's our first window you can just click op first select it click option you go to change fill go click there then we change the color I want a little bit of bluish then you click OK then you click OK then I want this to be under my fly body because it's just like the, the same object just drag it then you put it drag it and put it straight on, the, on your fly body you just put it under it then I can see okay this is like my same object when I'm moving it I'm moving everything at the same time because like it's under my fly object it's under my fly body so uh, from now I can use like the rectangle just select it I just uh, up make a small window there just uh, put it around here then uh, the first thing I'll do just open just click option there change color fill you go straight there you click there then you click this then you click there so the reason I'm using this I'm telling it okay just take it taking this I, I, I'm telling it I want this color then it will just go straight to it then I click OK then I click OK then it will be the same color then I write just uh, um, select it first you just click option you just just write to win let me just write to win so that you can understand this is the window then you click control C you click control V so what I did here I just copied that same window and I pasted it so I can drag it to the left then I click control C again I click control V to copy and paste again the same another window then I put it there then I can now come here click option then I write uh, OK control Z I didn't know what happened there okay this is my window one C select the second window you just click it here you rename it uh, call it like a window two. Uh, select this in option, rename it, call it like the window tree. Then um, you can just take select this one. You can just put it under your, your under there. Then you can just put your windows under your window one. It's then your windows that just combine. So this is a strand of your windows and that is your flight so nothing changed if I'm moving my flight everything moves because everything still drooped under my flight so now what I want to do I want to do like the, uh, the I will call it a fin I don't know what you guys call it I don't even know the name of it but I'll just call it a fin for now just select there I just put it like um, select there, select there, and I select there. Okay, I don't know is that a good shape for it, but I believe so. A fin, I don't, I, I believe like you don't have to look uh, exactly like your plane. So I'll go for a little bit of that color reddish on it. Then um, just click on that select, just select it so you can reshape it can reshape it and just make sure this is exactly what you want it's kind of funny so I have just to drag this one to come up like that okay I think um, that is not really bad just drag it and you put it straight there uh, just double click it and you write a fin a back fin fin back 
okay then I write another thing uh, no this is what I want okay then I write it a uh, side fin fan side okay I just also drag it then you put it straight to the body of your airplane then you can take uh, this one you drag it and put it straight to the top of the fin then I can just click this one just make sure you just selected the one only one then you click here you go straight to your color then I uh, just have to move this because I want to tell it that I want that specific color but it seems that I won't be able so you gotta click this move it that way click here then you click that thing it tells I want this color on my fan on my fin then it will change and be the same color not really bad not really 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 bad guys I hope you can see we just try to to make it um I want to create a little bit of a uh, okay let me just leave it like that I believe um, let me just leave it like that so I believe this guys will be the first uh, tutorial so uh, just wait for the second one the second one I'll be creating like um, I'll be creating uh, what do we do call this we, we, I'll be creating clouds on my second one so this is the first one so thank you guys so much for watching this one please don't forget to subscribe uh, make sure like you subscribe on this one and yeah see you on the next video thanks so much bless